that give you 10 15 minutes to sleep, to sing Kaplan Sensei, or Kaplan Friend, something like that. Don't hesitate, I know. You can just go up like that. Uh, oh, so you can go outside. There is a beautiful uh, sun, and it's not every day, I think, there is a beautiful sun here. Thank you. So, uh, some people in real estate think that real estate is, uh, is business, is making, a f find a building the cheapest possible, make the cheapest renovation possible, sell it the fastest possible, make the biggest margin, the big, biggest profit possible, and show baby uh, and leave. That is the way to do it. This way of uh, make real estate is just only 99% of the business. Some architects also think that uh, architecture is put together steel, concrete, glass, aluminium, boring things like that. This also represents 99% of the business of architecture. Uh, we are a little different because we are just this 1%. Uh, John and our partner uh, are not typical businessmen like that. First, they want to make things good, good for people. They have a real idea of quality. They want to make people happy. They want to be honest. They want to be respectful, which is good. Which is good because I think it's the same, and that's why we work together. For me, architecture is not steel, concrete, aluminum, and glass. It's more uh, vision, creativity, tenderness, uh, poetry, uh, humor, love, a lot of things like that which are human parameter and not material parameter. And this makes a difference. That's why you is different. Different, I'm sorry. Uh, that's why uh, the story starts when? 99. What? 99, that means what? Seven years, ago. Seven years ago, John arrived in my office and said, uh, I have an idea, perhaps we can make buildings together. And I said, oh, to do what? Uh, there is architects, there are a lot of people for that. I don't, I don't see the reason. And uh, English people are not very, very smart, but there is a very stubborn <laughs> that. And because they have no idea, they produce nothing, you know, that when they say, uh, uh, and you come back, and you come back, and you come back. When somebody comes back so much, you are obliged to make something to be polite, because French people, compared to English people, are very, very polite. <laughs> and uh, so that's why, at the, at the, at the end of time, he comes and said, I must be I must be I must be And finally, I said, yes, there is an idea. So this idea fit completely, finally, with all my life, what people call career, something like that. You know, I am very, very, very old now. I know I look so young, so sexy, but inside I'm very, very old. And I have spent uh, 20 years, perhaps 30 years or more, uh, always fighting, fighting, always working uh, in the most political way, the most human way, invent the democratic design, try to give the best to the maximum of people, try to, 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 to work on the injustice and things like that. Definitively, it's not easy because I'm just a Christmas gift designer. I am not a political man, uh, a journalist, uh, a singer who can redo the world in, in one day. For me, that needs uh, even more than one life. But well, still, because I'm a little stupid, uh, no, less than him, but still stupid, 
I continue to, to work and I consider myself like a maid with a broomstick who try to clean the life of my friends. My friends, that means my cultural tribe, my sentimental community. And uh, I do that with the Good Goods Catalog. Good Goods Catalog was the, the catalog of the no product for the no consumer of the next moral market. Uh, I do that with the first mail order, and something like that. When I see there is something to do, to help, I try to do it. And when I, I realize with John that finally when people must buy an apartment, they front to one of the biggest expense of their life. And these people can be lost. There is many ways to be lost before that. And even you are enough stupid to follow the media who tell you uh, wear pink uh, uh, this year after uh, wear green and things like that and every year you put your, your jacket in the garbage for an apartment it's a little more difficult to put in the garbage that's why I said what, what, what can we do to help uh, because if you have some money uh, you can rent an interior designer and this interior designer will make a beautiful apartment which will be shown in all the magazines and you will be so proud to be the magazine but at the end you will live in a museum, in a design museum and that will be horribly boring but more than that you will live in a place created by somebody else you will live in the brain of somebody else and uh, uh, especially the brain of an inter designer. I am an inter designer, and I can tell you, even me, I don't want to live in my brain. That's why you never rent an inter designer for your home, for hotel, for public space, and that, yes, definitely. But for a home, never. You must do that yourself. There is a rule you must build your home, your egg, uh, your cocoon. Uh, your life yourself. But you can need help because uh, you are a lawyer, you are a doctor, you know nothing about uh, Werner Banton, uh, you know nothing about uh, Philip Stark, and things like that. And, and, and it's normal. And you said, shit, how I can do that? You, it's uh, try to be a solution because I shall never, never make Peter design. I don't make private residential, no way. Uh, but how how help? Uh, the process is very simple. These people who are not so bad, even I don't agree completely with the brushing and the cravat and the are but they are good people. Uh, 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 they find the right vocation. They find the right building, and you agree, that's it. Uh, or the right land to build. Okay, they are known to be the best professional on the market. Good. After, we work, we work with local architects uh, to build well and things like that with a reality of quality. To tell you, to tell you something on the flag as you trace, there is something work luxus luxus what? Luxus I don't know what. I, I don't agree with this idea of lux. For me it's more the idea of quality. Or perhaps we can say that the real lux is quality in everything. And quality in everything we do it in the master plan. We try to have a noble proportion. We try to have a sort of serenity. We try to be uh, quiet. We try to have a deep elegance, something like that. Okay, floor plan are done, and modern also. Very modern, because if you see where we live today, it's a sort of a bad, small copy of a castle of the 15th, 15th century, when the, the maid was far in the kitchen uh, and the, the king somewhere in the salon. And the modern way of that is the, the wife 
uh, is somewhere in the kitchen, the children are hidden in a, in a closet, and the guys are watching TV in the salon. I think it's not so good for the couple or the family. That's why we work a little on that, on energy in the apartment. And when people have bought this apartment, after we play with them, a very simple game. We show pictures of a tree, of a piece of furniture, of a color, I don't know what. And uh, maybe the woman said, oh, I hate this color, I love this material, I love this tree, I like this car, I don't know what. At the end, you can say that this person is part of one of the four, of the four main families. It's a lot enough to, uh, to work on that. It's not, uh, you know, to be a rocket scientist. Uh, I create, do I create, I, I define, we can say, this four family with culture, classic, minimal, and nature. A lot enough. Uh, if this person says, I love this, I love this, we can say, okay, you are the more in, you feel comfortable in nature. If you agree with that, perhaps what you cannot move later, what is costly to move, to change, the floor, the, the table top, the kitchen, the material, the sweep of the bathroom, the handle, and like that, can be this. If you feel more classic, can be uh, darker wood, something like that, like that, you have the base. It's done. At this uh, step, step, uh, at this level, you can say, okay, thank you, thank you, uh, everything is perfect, I have my phone furniture from my computer, and everything is perfect. Or you can say, okay, thank you very much, I agree with that, I feel comfortable, uh, now you know I know nothing, I will be about design, can you help? And in some of the projects, we give a catalog of furniture, following the same family. And it's, uh, it's interesting because I am a designer. Before I was a designer, I am a designer. I know who are the good designers. I know who are the good producers. I know who are the bad designers. I know the people who make the copy and things like that. Because now design is so trendy, you have very good things, but also a lot of very bad things. That's why I can definitely guarantee it's the right product. Like that, uh, or you can take part or you take part a, small, a part of the project of the new project or the full pack but definitively I, I not design your place you design yourself that's why it's called you with the help of your friend of your friend who this friend have a know-how this know-how of real estate this know-how of design and furniture like that you are not lost and uh, like that I think we bring something more human. That's why uh, you is so different. Uh, that's why I am proud to say that you is a so big success across the world because it's not the same way of thinking. It's not the same angle of view. Uh, it's something more, I don't know how can call that, sentimental perhaps. Uh, when you say sentimental for a company, Perhaps even you can use uh, uh, other words which is a little ambitious, but why not? It's a little ethic. There is an ethic in your company. And I can tell you, in real estate, it's rare. That's a story. That's why uh, this project is a beautiful project because the building with a beautiful building, with a beautiful proportion, with a beautiful materials, and we have applied the same, the same rules. Also, these rules, there is some other part, which is the way we, 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 we work on the public space, on the common area. That is very, very, very important. Because uh, if I don't want to uh, work on your life, in your life, I think it's very important to work in, uh, I'm sorry, my English is not, is not good, in some part of your life. That means, if, if we speak about the lobby, the lobby, I do it always very strong. 
very innovative, very surrealist, very with a lot of poetry and things like that. Why? It's not just to make something nice, uh, pink and grey, and I don't know what. It's because when you will leave your apartment to go to work in the morning, uh, your lobby, you will, you will go through your lobby during what? 40 seconds, one minute, but every morning this lobby will tell you, remember you, that everything is possible. Creativity is everywhere. Even something completely crazy you, that remember you can do it, that open your mind. Every day you open your mind. And at night, when you, wake, wake, when you go home, perhaps the day was not so good, and you go through the lobby, and one more time, it's a sort of frontier. Frontier from the dark, grey, sad, boring outside, and you go home. It's clearly your home. But it's more than the home of you and your family. It's the home of your tribe. Because we don't try to please to everybody. We are not enough stupid for that. We just try to please to the people we love and who can love you. Love us. That's why uh, it's so personal, so special. Like that we select people all around the world. That's why you were only for one tribe. We are very proud to say that, to call this tribe the smart tribe. Because we know these people now. We check these people. We meet these people. And all these people are very interesting. They are very they are intelligent. They are aware. They are awake. And they are strangely all the same. You know, uh, the world now is no more made by geography. Geography is the old idea of uh, the 19th century and before. Now the world is made by different tribes. That means if you take Germany, Germany is not Germany like that. Germany is the addition of the tribe 1, tribe 2, tribe 3, something like that. And uh, if we take Japan, Japan is not just this, it's the addition of the same tribe like that. That's why now we work in parallel world. That's why uh, with you and my work mainly, we work for our tribe, the part of our tribe in Germany, in Italy, in Australia, in Japan, Hong Kong and things like that. That's why uh, 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 we know these people and we, we, we love these people and we make everything to make these people together. Uh, in, uh, in, uh, when in Boston, but today it's uh, where we in Montreal. In Montreal, there is something. I'm sorry. In Toronto. In Toronto, the same is something. Uh, in Toronto, in Toronto, when you arrive, you have the gym in the entrance of the building with bicycle, and you can make a race with the monitor like that with your neighbor. And after there is a long table. In the middle, like that, you can have a birthday, a party with everybody, the neighbor, make people party. We try to put the people together because our society is a, a more and more a schizophrenic society. People hate the other country, people hate the other religion, people hate the other people in the other city, people hate their neighbor, they hate their wife, they hate uh, their children, they hate themselves. We try a little to, to fight that. 